The new energy meter from SunGrow must be connected in order for the inverter to use all functions. The meter is mounted on a DIN rail 35mm and then connected to the phase and neutral voltage cable. Connect the voltage cable at the bottom in the green connector where it is marked with L1, L2 and L3. Make sure that the neutral cable, blue, is taken from the same point as the phase 1, 2, 3 cables. Make sure that phase 1, 2, 3 grid voltage are connected in the same order to the meter respecting the color code. Take out the three current transformers from the box and connect the blue-white cable and white cable to the pins 1 to 9. Take care of the color of the CT label. The white cable needs to be plugged into the first pin, blue-white cable in the second pin. If you also have the second set of CTs, then connect them to the pins 31 to 39 in the same way. If the meter comes with pre-installed shorting wires, please remove only the ones where you need to install the CTs and leave the other shorting wires plugged in. Then install the CT to the AC cable where the current must be measured. If you're installing the first set of CTs, they must be installed directly behind the main household meter at the point where the house is connected to the grid. The whole house must be measured by the CTs. The arrows of the CTs must point into the direction of the house load. That means they should point from grid to house. Double check that the CT for phase 1, 2, 3 are connected on the right phase and to the right pins on the meter. SunGrow provides two sizes of CT compatible with the meter. 100 amps is the default option, but 250 amps can also be purchased separately and is installed in the same way. At the bottom of the inverter, above the communication connector, you will find a table with information about which cable has to be plugged into which port. The smart meter is connected from the meter port A to the inverter port A2 and from the meter port B to the inverter port B2. No settings in iSolar Cloud are required. Once the meter is correctly connected to the three-phase hybrid inverter, it will be automatically recognized.